lights turning on and off? Flickering of lights usually conjures scary imagination, but actually it's not an apparition or a ghostly encounter. Although it is a strange thing that happens to our light bulbs at home, it's not because there's a ghost or a white lady or something. This flickering of a light bulb is a condition that occurs because of electrical issues. However, there's still reason to be spooked, since this might be an early sign of a larger electrical problem which eventually may lead to house and electrical fires. You now wonder what are its causes? Let's see it. This is Mylene by the way and here's all you need to know about flickering lights. One most common cause of flickering lights is loose bulbs. This condition means the socket does not have a proper contact with the bulb which causes recurrent flickering. In short, this indicates that the light bulb is not secure. Thus, it obtains inconsistent power which eventually leads to inconsistent lighting. In this case of loose bulbs, this is primarily one of the easiest to fix cause of flickering light bulbs. This can be solved by simply turning off the fixture and allow the bulb to cool. Then, try to tighten the bulb to make sure it is tight enough in the socket. By repairing loose bulbs, it means we do not put the consumed energy to waste, thus avoiding wasted energy output. If it has been found out that the bulb is not loose, then the second thing to check into is a wiring connection. Loose connections in an outlet, light, or switch box can lead to arcing. This occurrence is where an electrical current jumps over gaps in the connection. If the circuit connection is loose, there is now a formation of a high resistant point which creates dangerous heating points. Once this happens, the whole system can be threatened by a single loose link. This one cause of flickering of lights can lead to electrical fires. The steps in fixing these problems involve first to power off the suspected wall switch, light fixture, or outlet. After this, one can now detach the cover plate. With the use of a flashlight, one can quickly check the screw terminals inside where the wires are connected. If loose wirings are found, careful tightening of the screw terminals down onto the wires will fix the problem in hand. However, keep in mind that this is very dangerous to handle without being professional in this field. Hence, it is better to call an electrician to guarantee safety and prevent electrical and house fires. It is vital to recognize power surging devices as it can impair electrical components that are in connection with our houses. It is an essential consideration as power surges can lower the life expectancy of those affected electrical components. Of our houses of around 200 amp for the main electrical service. When turning on large appliances at home, these extract a large amount of current that can lead to the flickering of lights. When flickering happens once we turn on our large appliances, this event is called voltage fluctuation. It is the regular change in voltage that happens when devices or equipment requiring a higher load are used. The remedy for this would be through the use of a power quality analyzer that would be of great help to measure voltage fluctuation. It can serve as an aid to prevent nuisance stripping and seeks what equipment causes the flickering problem. Also, there is an event capture feature that shows waveforms and significant supplementary data. Tracing those appliances that pull out large currents can lead us to invest in energy-efficient appliances. Flickering of light can also be the after effect that signals that the light bulb life is dying. It may indicate that the light bulb is near the end of its lifespan. It is commonly the cost if the light bulb referred is fluorescent light bulb. This light bulb is likely to flicker when they reach 75% of their lifespan. With a dying light bulb, it serves as an indication that the house owner would need to replace the light bulb. In light bulb replacement, it is better to use LEDs or light emitting diode or CFL or compact fluorescent light bulbs instead of fluorescent light bulbs since the latter are prone to flicker as it reaches a fraction of its expected lifespan. 
Replacing light bulbs at home from fluorescent to LED or CFL can help save energy or reduce energy consumption as these can help save up to 70% energy by using less electricity and are more reliable than the other light bulbs. One final cause of flickering is dependent on the type of light bulb used. There are instances that the flickering is normal. It likely happens in fluorescent lights that often utilize an inductive ballast to control the amount of current in the bulb. With this, there can be a power disruption as it runs through the bulb, and then it will cause the bulb to flicker. Hence, there is no need to worry about this instance as it can be considered normal. As I have said previously, it is better to install LEDs or CFLs at home instead of fluorescent light bulbs since both can save our energy and lessen or reduce our energy consumption at home. This has been my mean saying a flicker makes a good light bulb picker and remember, a good picker saves electric bill from going higher. Be smarter, be a good checker. And that's all you need to know about flickering light bulbs.